men, they would just never get it. I don't know, this is a motorbike, but it really feels like I'm working out. I just, I don't like me with my hair. I'm single, newly divorced. <laughs> Celebrating my <laughs> I know that I am in my like loner era. Cheers to the girls weekend. Because you better watch, watch those B-words. These bitches ain't better than me. Hey y'all, so today I was not supposed to be vlogging today at all. Actually today I wanted to be by myself. I wanted to be left alone. And y'all know how much I like being left alone. I know that I am in my like loner era and I'm trying to get out of it. So yesterday I was like, oh, I'm just gonna stay at home because I feel overwhelmed with like work. And like, I just feel really overwhelmed right now, which is why I just needed this weekend as like, I guess self care. I guess a self care weekend just to like take care of myself and like give myself space to not do much. And I know that I want to be by myself and left alone right now but that doesn't necessarily mean that I have to be like in the bed on the couch eating a bunch of bad food like you know just in the slums and putting myself in a depression usually when I say that I'm going to be to myself that's usually what that means is that I am in the bed and I'm tired of being in the bed okay I need some fresh air Fresh air me, please. And just because I want to be by myself does not mean that I have to be in the slums. So that is why I wanted to pull out my camera because y'all are my accountability partners, whether you like it or not. Hi, hello. Here's the sign-up sheet. <laughs> Thank you. Like whenever I pull out the camera, y'all know I'm just like very, very fresh. Like a fresh, brand new born baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm like very fresh into the vlogging world. And I'm just starting to feel like every time I pull out my camera, like I feel the urge to like do something. And I think that's a good thing. So, we're gonna figure out something to do. <laughs> I don't want company, but y'all are my company. Hi. <laughs> So I do have a few other videos that I have to edit for TikTok because I'm really behind. Like I just keep recording videos over and over and over and over and over again. I keep recording them, but I'm not editing. Like what's going on? But I am hungry. I was gonna make something light like a smoothie, but I want some eggs real bad. Hey, And I laid in my bed. It's like an hour later. I decided maybe we should just go biking. I haven't been biking in a minute. Obviously, like I live in New York. I ran into one of y'all. Speaking of, I ran into one of y'all in Sephora. Wish I remember the girl's name. I think it was Nicole. But she was like, I didn't know you lived in New York. I thought you lived in Atlanta. I thought that was so funny because I don't know. It just, do I give Atlanta? I'm, I live in New York, y'all. <laughs> so we're gonna go biking. I haven't gone biking at all all summer. A lot of people bike in New York and they, they just, I don't know what that is. I feel like I would die if I biked in the street. I literally cannot bike in the street at all. So what are we gonna do instead? And also I'm not really in the mood for like a workout. I'm not in the mood to use the leg muscles. What we're going to do instead is we're going to go to the Prospect Park. I'm gonna get a motorbike. <laughs> it's gonna cost me twice as much. What's the weather giving right now? I feel like it's finally starting to get a little chilly out. So yeah, I'm about to go out and we're gonna uh, get on the bikes. And I also wanted to go and get some new running shoes. Oh, it's, it's a little bit of a walk to Prospect Park, which is good because I want to get out and walk for a minute. I'm gonna get my headphones. I don't know if it's just me, but like every time I need to use my headphones, they're dying. Every time I need to use my headphones, they're dying. My Apple Watch is working. I don't really care because I'm not really trying to schedule, I'm not trying to log a workout right now. Yeah, so we're about to go there. I'm not gonna bring my camera with me. I'm probably just gonna bring a little iPhone. I ended up putting on my wig because I thought I looked a mess without it. Good decision because I was looking a mess. I felt like I looked sleepy all day today. I don't know, this is a motorbike, but it really feels like I'm working out my legs. I can't. Good. I 
feel like you just gotta find your sweet spot because getting here was so difficult for me. I almost had a panic attack. Y'all know what you scare me? The real, the real bikers. I've been feeling like I'm in their way. They be like, move, bitch. I'm like 1000% positive that this is like half motorbike, half you do the work. This bike said, get your ass up and work. Nobody wants to work these days. <laughs> Cause that hill had me, oh my God. I did one round, I'm about to do another and then maybe get off. I ended up coming to get running shoes. Just got sized. But I really, really want some watermelon, so I think I'm gonna stop at Whole Foods real quick. Because I really, really want some. I'm on a whole nother level. These bitches is out of their league. These bitches ain't out of their me. These bitches ain't better than me. Nikki gotta release that now. Okay, y'all, so I'm back home. As you can tell, I got a little bit of energy. I actually ended up stopping and going to get me some new running shoes. If you saw my video before this, I'm starting to train for the marathon and we needed some new running shoes. I went to go stop. They like had me like walk. They were like, walk back there and we gonna see, you know, what your foot style is or whatever. So I need y'all to see, hold on, wait, give me a second. Cause I don't know what they talking about. You see me walking? You see me? My check one time, one check one time. Radio check one more time, one more time. Here go my feet right here. <laughs> you better walk, you better walk, you better walk. In your lavender. And don't look at my crusty feet, bro. They had me, oh my God, y'all. My butt is literally on fire right now from that. Anyway, I don't even remember the name of what they told me. They you said this long name. They were like, have you ever heard of such and such? And I was like, no, never heard of her. It's basically when, you know, your feet are like this. It should be like this. Your feet are like this. So when you run, I basically need something that helps level out my feet because I naturally, I guess, stand like this. I wanted to get some Hoka so bad, but they told me that the Hoka's that we they had in the store just were not good for me. And also, I like whenever I start running, it hurts. Like it's been like this for years. Like it's not just because I'm getting older. Okay, we're never gonna get credit to that ever. Okay. Since like I first started running when I was in college, I had never ran. Okay, that's not my thing. Every time I start running, like my my ankles crack a little. Like my ankles sort of have to get used to what it's doing. Like it hurts, and then I can start running. Like it probably hurts for like two minutes, and then my ankles start to loosen up. But my ankles are like really really tight. Anyways, this is not time for me to release all my problems out on y'all. <laughs> We have a million Asics. First running shoes that I ever got were Brooks. We all know that Brooks, if you don't know, Brooks is like, they're, they're so ugly. So ugly. But they get the job done. It's more about functionality than style. So I ended up getting these because this gives me the ankle support that I need. And it also gives me the stability down at the bottom. And they also gave me a size bigger because apparently your shoe was supposed to be a size bigger than what your feet actually are. I'm wondering if my feet grew because I've always thought that I was a size 7. And they told me that I was a size 8. <laughs> And they gave me an eight and a half, and I'm like, what's going on? But these are cute. I actually like these. I'll leave a link down below if you're interested in trying them. They are the GT 2012. They're really cute, and they like really cozy at the bottom. I also ended up going to Whole Foods, which I should be in the kitchen with this. I don't know why I have this out here. So I have to take this trash out. Cover your eyes. <laughs> So I got these cookies, pumpkin season. They're only a hundred calories for one cookie. There are 12 cookies in here. Mmm. 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 Look at me, I'm putting them back up. I might eat them later tonight, but I'm not about to eat them right here. Pumpkin spice girlies link up. I got some watermelon. I told y'all when I was walking, I was really craving watermelon. So I got some. I only got this little one. I wanted the big one. This little one was $6, which is already very steep because of normal watermelon. Only reason why I don't get the watermelon because I'm not, 
What do I look like? Muscle man? I'm not carrying watermelon home like these. Oh, what's the bigger bowl? $16. Last but not least, I went. I got me my kombuchas. I got like three of them. And you know what I need to do before I do anything else? Because I actually want to clean up a little bit. Oh, I didn't even tell y'all. Remember when I said that I was moving out? Because they was raising the rent like crazy. Girl, I'm not moving out. <laughs> Talk about negotiating one-on-one. -on -one. <laughs> you know, the number one rule of negotiation is silence. Shut the up. And then we went back and forth on the pricing and they only put me up just a little bit. Not too much. I mean, just a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. I'm going to be honest. It is a lot. It's a lot more. But it's not the crazy amount that they sent me the first time. I win. <laughs> you lose. <laughs> oh, y'all. I actually have to do another hair video. I really want to know y'all thoughts. Like, do y'all like those videos of me, like, showing me with the new hairstyles? Or should I like X those out? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like they're getting so repetitive now. And I know that I get questions on like my wigs. And so I try to like make those videos as like long form videos. Instead of y'all having to dig through all my shorts or like dig through or whatever. Like I don't know. Like they're so different than these vlogs that I do. They're very much so sit down and like we're not talking. We're just talking about the wig like not giving like a one-on-one -on -one connection it's giving just let me show you how to do this um let me know if y'all like that because i will stop now, granted i do get paid for but i am very picky about the type of wigs that i decide to work with because i i can't stand a bad wig baby i cannot stand a bad wig and i'm entering in this era where like now i'm making wigs and i want the wigs to be put on as easy as possible and like i just do not have time to like build a, build a bear build a wig like i used to putting on the bleach and like you know doing all of that it's just so much involved in that and i do not want to do that no more so i always try to get wigs that are very easy that I find, think that y'all would like but let me know if you don't like those videos and I will cut them out or I would try to like put them in these videos just like real quick instead of just like a quick short like seven eight minute video on that unless y'all don't care let me know let y'all girl oh, no. I got this hair and I gotta make a video about it it should have already already been put out but it's another blonde wig <sighs> tired of the fucking blonde wigs i hate to be honest with you i hate 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 that this wig came with baby hairs you see this what did y'all do that for who asked for that my cousin was telling me that this hair color looks good on me y'all know how i feel about blonde hair on me y'all know i don't like it I feel like I gotta put on makeup every time I put on a blonde wig. Mind you, the wig is not done, so I don't need judgment on like how the wig actually looks. Like, I actually, I'm okay with this. It's a little thin. It's a little thin. It's a minimal tracks, but this is a cheap wig. Can't really ask for too much. But I don't know. What should I do with this wig? I can't do much because this is not a full lace wig. This is like one of those like 13 by 6, you see. I'm gonna have to put some foundation on this lace. I don't. The lace is a little bit lighter. I just, I don't like me with blonde hair. I feel like, and what's crazy is I get the most, like the most compliments that I get when it comes to hair is blonde hair. Or that ugly ass bob that y'all said that y'all liked. <laughs> I don't like none of the hairstyles that people like on me. Hate them all. I'm about to sit and I'm about to film this video real quick. It should not take long because you see this wig already fits pretty snug already. So it's not going to be nothing that I need to do. I just need to style it. <laughs> Diddy ate up that album, the red album. I don't know what it's called. I think it's the red album. I have no idea. But he ate that album up. That album is so good. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to lie to you. This is cute too. Okay, my ADHD is going cray cray right now. Like, I know I said that I wanted to be in the house, but... So let me just call this. Hello? Hello? What are you doing? I'm TV. What are you doing tonight? I'm going to Ludlow House. Ludlow House? I, I guess so. I was actually wanted to go to dinner. I just, uh, yeah, I'm just making this wig right now. So I'll be done in like, probably like an hour. All right. Bye. I guess I'm going out. Which means I have to hurry up. And I cannot be out all night because I just said that I want to go to church. <gasps> my lashes. Oh my God. Wait, I have fake lashes to put on. Mm -hmm. I just hate these now. 
<laughs> now I have to figure out what to wear. When he say just get fab, I know what that means. I haven't been out in so long. I don't know what to wear. Look at y'all in the slums of my closet. <laughs> Girl, I can't think about clothes right now. I literally have to film this video. So I will see y'all in a minute. All right, bye. Okay, hey y'all, we're back. We're back, we're back. I have like five minutes. I told y'all my toe was messed up, but I'm the one to ask for this. Don't have any other shoes to wear other than some open toe joints. Oh, I just got to paint over this real quick. This is hardcore female tings right now, bro. The men, they would just never get it. My hair came out cute also. I would have loved curls, but I genuinely did not have time for curls. Ugh. This day turned out to be totally different than what I anticipated about coming out. But I find that those are my favorite vlogs. Do you see how I just made that call? Pick up the phone, baby. Oh, I got ready in good time and damn, I filmed a video. I've been blogging all day and I redid my toe. But he's like 20 minutes away. He said he was gonna be here at nine. It's 8.58. All right, y'all, I'm about to hurry up and try to get ready and then you will see me in the car with Dez. Y'all met Dez before, but not really, really. I didn't bring my camera. Remember, that was the day that my camera broke. So I'll see y'all in a minute. I'm about to put on these shoes. It's a vlogging night! Wow! Ah! I'm screaming. <laughs> it's It's giving Detroit. It's giving D for Desmond. It's giving Detroit, dog. That's the Desmond. Detroit look. <laughs> he want to be a Detroit boy so bad. So we're at right now. Look at this. If you haven't met me, I'm good. They saw you for your birthday. Oh wow. I didn't yeah. see you for my birthday. So we ended up changing our reservation. We were supposed to go to cafeteria. Only thing that I know about cafeteria was that it was a sex in the city and that was where the gays went. But also we're at two forbidden places courtesy of Real Housewives. Real Housewives of New York. So we're at Catch. You ever watch Real Housewives of New York? They said that would never catch me at catch. Were you catching us at catch? <laughs> Look at us. Post it, baby. I had my first cash roll. Oh my I God, love yes. cash so much. I love their vegan options. Like their vegan options are really good. It's really thoughtful. Like it's really good. But I always get jealous of people when they had a cash roll. Because people say how good it is. And now I get to try it. <laughs> I'm here for it. You gotta have a good night. And we'll. Cheers to the girl. Weekend. You better watch those B words. Did you watch the Carlos King interview? Which one? The Nene Leaks. That's good. I actually love Carlos. He should have stayed and he should have tried candy. He could have still been there. What you he, mean? He fed Phaedra and Bushra that shit about uh, candy, drug, and Portia. Really? about Desmond, he's gonna pick up the cutest guy before anybody else. Wait, Indian shorter. Who said I'm gay? I'm not on that shit, bro. Go ahead, Desmond, with your jeans. Get your ass in the shower. <laughs> my feet are killing me. It's so crazy. I'm just ready to get back to my lifestyle, child. What lifestyle? My lifestyle of just spending my money. The way I want to. You already do that. I do, but <laughs> you know my situation. <laughs> Fuck. Shit. Fuck. <sighs> it's the weekend, and um, I'm here. This is my first, so don't judge me. This is my first makeup tutorial. Oh, I hope I help somebody. Help somebody. Help somebody. Help somebody. You can appreciate me reaching out. out. At the grocery store, it's, it's crazy. Insane. It's my and favorite part right here. You wrote it on your face. Right here. We saw the damn toilet paper. Here it comes. You just wrote it on your face. What? Move your bag. Here it comes. Move your bag. And you wrote it. Ooh. 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 Got a little burn to it. Burn. Shit. <laughs> what happened brown. to him? The problem is Desmond doesn't realize I have heels on. I'm not trying to walk two, three blocks it's to go block, get somewhere. Girl. It's a block. Block, bitch, block. <laughs> Walk a high yellow. Reaching out. I look so good. See how you do. You look fab. I'm so glad to call you my friend. Not because you look fab, but like, just because like you're my friend. Actually. <laughs> 
It's my time to vlog. <laughs> Go ahead, take it. Yeah, What's up, y'all? We're headed to Lolo House. Right, my friend. Breakdown exactly. We're headed to Lolo House. My friend Brent is DJing tonight. We're ready to have a good time uh -huh. and show the world who we are. Right. If y'all want to follow me on my socials. I'm screaming. <laughs> Period. I'm single, newly divorced. <laughs> Celebrating. <laughs> We're going to my divorce party. <laughs> I seen off brown sugar when he was like celebrating my divorce. Literally. <laughs> but you guys can follow me on Instagram. Always better in person. So what you see online is not what you're gonna get in person. Well, listen now. I'm not a vlogger. I'm not about to walk to Lolo House with a damn Just camera in my hand. It's so crazy. Black women smoking cigarettes. What's really going on? Comment, like, su subscribe if you think I should start my own vlog. If you think I should be an influencer, let me know now. Because I feel it in my spirit. I feel it in my Shondo. Like this girl. <laughs> Cute. Ah! Uh, come here. Oh, that's my baby. Okay, period. That's my babes. Get to my man. Here's a little aloha, y'all. Right here's good, sir. Cuties. Shout out to the. It's the girls' weekend. <laughs> You better watch, watch those B words. words. <laughs> 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 Friends, so we're back home. I am about to get into the shower. My voice is a little warm. It's four thirty. Why didn't y'all tell me to go home? I'm, I'm so happy I hung out with y'all for the weekend. I'm really um. I can't see y'all right now as I'm filming this. But it's like I know you're there. And I'm about to, probably about to have that half of the cookie that y'all saw me eat earlier. I don't know if I'm going to church tomorrow because I'm so tired as fork. I was happy I went to catch because I really wanted that salad and fries. Like, I was really craving a salad and fries situation. And they have the best salad and fries situation for me. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. I love you so much. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.